Alright guys, welcome back to another reaction. Um, it's a little laid out, but I, I wanted to get a reaction out because I saw a video that I've been asked to react to for quite a bit, so I figured today is going to be the day I do it. And also, I hope you guys enjoy the new uh, camera angle. I've been trying to switch around my bedroom a little bit, and I think it looks pretty good. Anyways. Um, yeah, we're gonna be reacting to another video from the SMG4 theorists. It's gonna be a uh, Watfi 2024 theory, which I'm very excited for because Watfi looks amazing so far. Well, it looks promising. So let's let's not jinx it because I thought Watfi 2023 was gonna be fantastic, which it was okay. But anyways, uh, that being said, let's roll the intro. I don't have anything else to say. All right, so here it is. You guys know the the drill <laughs> link in the description all that good stuff full credit to them not me and yeah so yeah <laughs> i don't I, I don't really don't i'm really failing today as a reaction guy right, let's do this in three two one is this the guy from puzzle vision after show is this the same voice actor? This sounds very familiar. They should ask me to voice it. No, I'm kidding. No, this guy's a really, really, really fucking good. So good for good for him. If it, if it is. Yeah, it sounds just like him. Well, it's good to see him back voicing the guy. Man, that gave me a nostalgia of that shit. No, no, what are you, what are you continuing the after show series? Kind of true. I mean, I think I'm funny, but no one can No, I'm kidding. I'm not funny at all. I'm just loud. Is he talking to me? Because this feels really personal. P personal. I feel it personally attacked here, bud. Okay, baby. Okay, we're gonna need to work on that uh that evil laugh, buddy. Nair, 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 nair. Love the intro. Welcome to SMG4 Theory. Wait a minute! The guy who voices Mr. Puzzles at Puzzle Vision After Show is a member of SMG4 Theory? That's awesome! I love that! Alright, let that. Not in danger of being replaced by a corporate entity. I am your host, T. And after almost a full year since Watfi 2023, yeah, my God, finally returned in the SMG4 series <laughs> and works better than ever. Well, he can talk now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Stephen Hawking. In his appearance, Marty reveals his bitter hatred for Mario, vowing his revenge on him and the SMG4 crew after Mario betrayed their friendship in a favor of a plate of spaghetti. Spaghetti, 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 spaghetti. <laughs> left Marty to what? In a jail cell Damn. for a year. Alone, unable to move, seemingly stuck in that box indefinitely because his only friend ditched him. What an asshole. Oh, spaghetti. But he wasn't stuck forever. No, 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 no. He was saved. Marty was saved and given extra upgrades to boot. But now... But who? The is, who? Mr. Puzzles, calling it now. Marty from this twisted fate. 
Well, considering the circumstances of needing to acquire tech oh. skills to provide oh. the rocket power oh. wheelchair oh. and voice. I'm drinking. Don't make joke. It's jokes. It's jokes. Bro. It's only logical for the culprit to be the one, the only Mr. Puzzle. Oh, yeah. Thank you, all too kind. To prove Mr. Puzzle, I still love the fact that the, the voice of Mr. Puzzles from Puzzle Vision After Show is in this channel. Man, when is SMG4 Theories gonna like? I've reacted to like how many videos of theirs now? Like, when am I gonna get invited on there? Like, don't you guys wanna see that? I'm kidding. Well, not, but also, like, it's fine. Mr. Puzzle I love watching their videos. To be especially skilled in creating extremely advanced devices that would be sure to win second place at the school science fair. <laughs> Breaking the shoulder volcano, taking away what's rightfully mine. This technological prowess was initially demonstrated within It's Gotta Be Perfect. Mr. Puzzles creating the well, Yeah, I want to get more lore on this shit, and it really feels like they're going to start explaining that, which I'm very, I'm very, very happy with, because uh, the, current, the, the current lore on what we got is... Advert that gave SMG4 the demon keyboard. Cause like I it, okay I'm sorry for keep for keeping on pausing I just I have a lot to say right now, um, because like I've been seeing so many fan creations that tell Mr. Puzzle's story better than the actual writers of SMG4 and like that's just I'm not saying that like like SMG4 has to be perfect at writing I'm just saying that you should probably like look into the issue on why people are complaining about your quality because it feels like we're just getting quantity at this point i'm okay with waiting every two weeks for an episode or whatever the fuck just make the writing good because it's recently it just hasn't been the newest episode is good though really good gave the grind on the perfect video later during western spaghetti mr puzzles was heavily implied to have built the digital world that ren used he to did in smg4 and the crew this new reality was crafted so thoroughly and close to life that even the cast sure. was incapable Ow. of realizing that they weren't in the real world mr puzzles having built an invention of such great magnitude fully puts into perspective of how much of a tech whiz he is if you're somehow not well it's because he has a tv as a head so the editing is getting a lot better, I'm going to say. It's time to move on to his motives for doing so. Like Marty, Mr. Puzzles despises the SMG4 crew. Yeah, but how did SMG... Sorry, how did Mr. Puzzles find the SMG4 crew? When are we getting that? Especially Mario. Yeah, fair Mario enough. has been the main cause for Mr. Puzzles' mental breakdowns as of late. With the most recent occurrences being Mario reverting Maggie out of her leggy state. And Mario becoming friends with Pedro, leaving Mr. Puzzles in the dust but my oh. ruining thing i hated that episode i hated that episode <clears throat> but it's also i got roasted in the comments because i mistakenly said that that wasn't like that they switched voice actors i made bullshit up i was ugh, i'm sorry i thought it was nothing new we're as far back as Mr. Puzzles' incredible game show spectacular. Mario ruined Mr. Puzzles' show. <laughs> the no no's, I remember that. That was amazing. Oh, uh, yeah, he was, that was a creepy episode. His show ratings and Mario's escape. Mario's escape was the catalyst. God. God. I'm going to go on a rant for a minute, guys. So just listen for a, for a fucking millisecond. They could have done so much with that ending. Because I thought Mario was going to be the underdog that saves the day. I thought he was going to be the guy that, like, we're finally getting, like, where Mario's the hero. He's not just a dumbass. He breaks out into the real world. I thought they were going to do something really cool. But the movie was so underwhelming with what, look, what looked like. I don't know. I just feel like it was falsely advertised. That's just, that's just me, though. List to the eventual because man man Mario back in the original puzzle vision arc that was like hype that was so hype the set events where mario could destroy mr puzzles is set to give enough i hope we could go back to that because to escape man i i love the character mr puzzles he means so much to me his five stars and crushed his dream for creative control leading to his best song to boil. okay that's the best thing that came out of like that movie was creative control 
I, I still listen to that song to this day. Where shown as of now. You, you somehow continue to come up with unique and creative ways to ruin my life. I will get you, Mario. I'll get all of you. So how exactly will he get Mario? Well, stab do him. For, and that, of course, running a show. Not just any show, however. No, he'll be the direct host for an annual event of such great proportion that it is sure to grab the attention of all citizens across the Mushroom Kingdom and finally give him the recognition he's been dying for. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Not just any show, however. No, he'll be the direct host for an annual event of such great proportion. Okay, this is new. This is like, okay, like I'm saying like that render, this is, this was made recently. I'm going to show you guys something that I just fucking noticed. Uh, shit. So, we're, I'm, we're just quickly going to my Discord server. I made this, like, th almost three months ago. Look. Exact same font and everything. I'm not saying he watches my stuff. I'm just saying it's a really weird coincidence, don't you think? Anyways. That it is sure to grab the attention of all citizens across the Mushroom Kingdom and finally give him the recognition he's been dying for. And deserves. All right, I'm sorry that man deserves some recognition. Recognition. I'm here to say that Mr. Puzzles will be running as the host for What V 2024. In the recent community post made by SMG4, a letter containing a. Yeah, that's actually a good point. It actually might be Mr. Puzzles because SMG4 himself is even holding the ticket. So that means they all got invited. I didn't even notice that. Ticket for a new carnival Bro, I always get goosebumps when I watch this channel. SMG4 himself. Reading the ticket closely shows a link to the website for Watfi 2024. Keep this letter in mind. Okay. Opening up the webpage for Watfi 2024... It is revealed that the theme of the next Watfy is going to be carnival based. And this info is crucial in proving the point of Mr. Puzzles being the host of Watfy. Okay. Okay, let me explain. When closely analyzing what the community post for the invitation said, it is obviously trying to point us observant theorists in a certain direction. <laughs> Who the heck sends letters these days? Well, I sure know one guy oh. obsessed with sending letters. In both Western Spaghetti and the previous Watfy, Mr. Puzzles sent letters stamped with his insignia to both Ren and Marty, leading to them becoming the antagonists of their respective movies. Bro, this motherfucker pieced it together. I didn't even notice that shit. That's awesome. ...to it being Mr. Puzzles, but for further proof, Mr. Puzzles also has the look of a circus ringmaster. His gloves, long button-up jacket, black pants, bowler cap, and even down to his bow tie. Mr. Puzzles just is a distinguished like gentleman. A circus. And so it went up. But can I just mention that we literally mentioned this in our first theory? It's insane that standing point applies even better now than it did then. Oh, and to quickly disprove anyone saying that SMG4 will be the showrunner, it was explicitly shown in the community post that SMG4 received the letter. And we've learned in the past to take the community posts 100% seriously. So no, Fair enough. he's not going to be the host. And the final nail in the coffin for Mr. Puzzles being the host is the fact the old Puzzle Vision website was actually transformed into this one. Yeah, I don't really know what else to say. I mean, that website was used to show Mr. Puzzles. Yeah, I remember shows. that. I remember that. So After the end of every Puzzle Vision episode, I went to go rate it. Because the one time I didn't, people were like, were inform me, informing me about this website. I was like, oh, okay. Only stands the reason that Mr. Puzzle. Man, I really am an idiot. Newest show on there, and means that he's the host of the next What Fee. And as already mentioned earlier, Mr. Puzzles broke Marty out of prison in order to get his help for revenge against Mario. Therefore, he would take the role of a secondary antagonist. He could possibly Sorry, I'm jamming that into song. the challenges to act as a rival to the cast, while Mr. Puzzles runs the carnival. Now that we've established Mr. Puzzles and Marty as working again, it would be so cool if there is an arc eventually where it brings back every main villain from like arcs and they team up 
and like do like this like big end game style thing and then we have to get like so like every smg4 character that'd be so cool like i know they probably won't ever do that but that'd be so cool if they did so cool thanks to cast as the showrunners what is their exact plan for revenge well i have one theory an smg4 theory so crazy so unfathomable that you can never believe the my brain about to leave my mouth all right that is unless you read the title of this theory then you would know exactly what i'm about to suggest that's right theorists i believe that mr puzzle and marty's ultimate plan for revenge is for them to replace Mario as the avatar of the universe. For those who don't know what the avatar of the universe means. Okay, I'm I'm listening. Our theory on the cosmology law. I reacted to that. For a quick explanation, here you are. The avatar of the universe basically <laughs> serves as the connective glue that keeps the universe intact. Ugh. When the glue is severed, or in this case killed, the entire universe comes down grumbling with it. Mario is the current avatar of the SMG4 universe, with characters such as Plum. SMG3 and Plum. 4 being sent to ensure that Mario stays safe and that the universe... Yeah, and they don't do a really good job of keeping him safe, because they constantly bitch at him, insult him, like, beat him, set him on fire. Like, they, they um, aren't good at what they're supposedly supposed to do. So, I'm so fucking over that fucking word. Doesn't go full emo and implant on itself. Now, you may be asking, why on earth would Mr. Puzzles and Marty try to replace Mario as the avatar? Because they hate him. It's exactly kind of obvious. To put it plain and simple terms, it's to game end him. Oh, I would never. Okay, now I've considered it once or twice, but can you really blame me? If Mr. Puzzles and Marty were to try and kill off Mario now, they would also be doomed to a horrible fate and could revel in the silence his death brings. Okay. However, if they were able to manage- I don't feel like they're actually gonna mention the cosmology lore because they don't really do that anymore. Marty, they could finally put an end to their greatest annoyance and gain the popularity and morality. It's a cool theory. I do want that to happen, but I also know the writing. And just to give more merit to this theory, let's take a quick look at our buddy Pedro, a fat Italian made just to replace Mario in an act of revenge by Mr. Puzzles. Now, why does this sound familiar? That's right. Pedro was just a test run to see if he could replace Mario. Oh, shit. Similar qualities. Now, this test of Bro. I keep getting goosebumps for this shit. Of Mr. Puzzles, meaning that it could never properly replace Mario. While you have someone like Marty, who was directly created by, by Mario. Mario. Oh my god! Dude! For a replacement of Mario for many reasons. To begin, as already stated, Marty was brought to life by Mario, which means they are somewhat linked, be it by soul, interests, all the creation of Marty could have even led to Mario sharing a part of his avatar heritage into Marty. That would if be cool. If Marty were to have become a part of this long line of avatar heritage established in the SMG4 theory Mario is Dead episode. It means Mario is a part of a long heritage of fat red Italian plumbers that go wahoo! He's just like the Avatar. This means much like the line of Mario's before him, he would be a viable replacement and could take over Mario's role of the Avatar. Mario and Marty being linked- All this for a fucking piece of cardboard? I just want to throw that out there. <laughs> for a piece of cardboard that we're all taking so serious? I mean, I have one behind me. I need to get a Marty cutout. Guys, get me to 12,000 subscribers, I'll get a Mar Marty cutout, okay? And it'll be in the back of all my videos. ...than we thought has actually been present in the SMG4 show ever since Marty's introductory episode of Mario is Fine. In this episode, Mario is locked inside of a float therapy box, and when dreaming of ways not to run his own pizzeria, he imagines there being two Marios in his dream, and then getting the idea for Marty. This is extremely important, because it shows that there have already been a precedent for Marty replacing Mario in the past just in a small role and Mario viewing Marty as essentially another version of him also shows that he believes that they must be closely connected so to summarize this theory Mr. Puzzles helped Marty to escape prison 
giving him the advancements of the voice box and the wheelchair, so that they could enact their revenge on Mario and the crew. They decided to trial Pedro as a replacement for Mario as the avatar of the universe. However, their plan completely failed when Mario befriended him. In a last ditch effort, the duo decided to set up a Watfy in order to mask fun challenges as a way to secretly integrate Marty in the role of the Avatar, using the fact that he is linked spiritually to Mario to ensure that he works as the next Avatar of the universe. Alright! kill Mario once and for all. You know what? Okay. Hey. That's just a theory. <laughs> no, but uh, they, uh, they should actually, like... The writers take notes. Just take notes from the fans, because this type of shit, that is something that I would watch. That is something that genuinely would like make me lose my mind while well, like watching that shit. That's just a theory. An SMG4 theory. Thanks for watching. No, that's my line, you son of a bitch. Oh, damn, dude. Kiss your mother with that mouth? <laughs> oh, that was great. That was great. All right, so that was SMG4 Theory, Mario Gets Replaced. I am actually really down with that theory being true. I hope it is. But also I do know, like, when it comes to the writing, they're like, in most recent, like most recent years, it's been very great to, uh, to meh. Like it's, it's either good or it's bad. It's no really in between where it's just, it's just okay. So let's hope that they can, um, well, let's hope that they can uh, fix that up for Watfi and make this the best one because I do have high hopes for it. Either way, that's going to do it for today's reaction, guys. A bit of a longer one, and I did talk a little more than I normally do, so sorry about that. But anyways, um, I had a lot of fun with this. Let me know what you guys think what's going to be happening in Watfi in the comments below. Uh, and yeah, uh, also be sure to check out the brand new energy episode because um, there's going to be a new one uh, coming out very soon. And a lot of big, big things on the way. I can't really say anything without spoiling stuff, but hey, I just hope you guys are there for the ride. Anyways, I love you guys all, and I'll be sure to see you guys in the next video. Bye bye